We're back, everybody. With more Shadow Hearts Covenant. What's this? A little girl wandering around alone so late at night? Hurry on home before there's another uprising. You can't rise up against me. You're a princess. Proud as it. With the Neva River running between... There's the Hermitage to the south and... Petro Pavlov's fortress to the north. I'm an artist, but new techniques are developed so quickly I just can't keep up with them all. Oh, it's cold. I think I'm going to freeze. Pierre is a tailor. Why doesn't he make me a warm coat? Can I help you? She has no mind. I feel like this would actually have to be the pillar that that treasure map was talking about now. Hmm. But I don't see a beautiful sunset. Maybe I... Oh, wait, wait, wait a moment, wait a moment. Maybe, I don't know. Then that doesn't seem like it'd be a very good treasure. Everybody talks against... Everybody talks against the Tsar, but his, poli but his politics didn't go bad until that damn Rasputin came to Russia. They said he cured Prince Alexei through his faith, but even that's questionable. Uh, what's going to become of Russia? All this war and hardship, all because of an imperial system that's been in place too long. I don't suppose a little kid like you can understand, but revolution's coming. I can feel it. I sneaked out to expose Rasputin's plot. If I get... I'll get caught if I go back in now. Oh. So that's the palace. Okay. I have to I have to patrol. This way will take me out of the city. Like, it always feels weird playing a game set in the real world. Even if it is yeah. fantasy. Carol in a hurry. Can't talk. I finally got a hold of some food and I'm bringing it home to my family. Oh, the life of the poor. Rescue. I knew it. I knew he wasn't going to the church like he said. Well, of course not. What need has the devil of the church, you know? I've been seeing a figure coming out of the palace in the middle of the night. I'm pretty sure it's Rasputin. That faithless, corrupt monk. What in the world could he be up to? Oh, we're about to go find out. Lev Anner. Did you know there's a secret tunnel to the palace somewhere here in town? My grandpa told me. So cold, do you think... So cold, do you think you're gonna die? Just drink some vodka then. The nights are still cold. 
The best thing to do on a night like this is go home, have some vodka, and collapse into bed. Agreed. It's unfortunate to snuff out a young life, but you have nothing to fear, my dear. Your family will follow soon afterwards. What did you say? Shout as much as you like. No one will come to help you. Kill her. See, that's really all Rasputin had to do in the movie. I've got to get Go to ahead, Edgar's shop. That's all he had to do, call on his boys. I mean, obviously Rasputin's got boys. <laughs> I think I'm safe here. You are not. Yuri is the helper of the princess. Hey, over here! Yuri's just too cool. Too cool for Scoop. Come on, Pendulum, give me your information. Now look this way. I got the Aqua Rays album. Let's hit him with the old fish face. Not very strong.
Nice job, Yuri. Beat his ass. I just hate to lose. I don't blame you, my man. <sighs> Are you okay? I'm fine. Oh, I'm so glad you're safe. Thank God, thank God. Oh, come on now. Don't make such a big deal about it. What do you mean, big deal? If these folks hadn't helped you, you would have been... I know, I know. I'm grateful already. <laughs> Anastasia got that sass. What's this? It is a gift. Please take it. Huh. She's a princess. Take Excuse it. It's gotta be valuable. Excuse me, miss. If I may, young lady, there's a much more important question than that. Why was that monster trying to kill you anyway? Rasputin, he's a kind of a dick. A royal princess's personal business is none of the affair of peasants. Let's just say that in this great world, there are those who choose to line themselves with the forces of good and battle Blanca's against not the dark it. forces of evil. Please, uh, forgive her. You love Yuri and Blanca. She's <laughs> always liked to daydream. Uh, don't take her seriously. I'm not daydreaming anything! Mm -hmm. huh. <laughs> You're just playing a block. Well, <laughs> my dear, it's probably nothing. Nothing to get too worried about. But that monster that attacked you looked a lot like a creature we fought. It was summoned by black magic. A powerful wizard, am I right? Do you know how to use magic, too, like Rasputin? Rasputin? Why did you all shout like that? Because we're here to beat down on Quit Rasputin. say it isn't true! You're not working with that dirty old man! You know Rasputin? Yes, I know him. Everybody says that. Because of him, my father's government has been completely ruined. Your father's government? Ruined? That's right. Uh, excuse me. Does that mean that you are... <sighs> she is Princess Anastasia Romanov. <laughs> Aww. Aww. <laughs> Oh, as if she didn't just sass us. <laughs> Do you mean to say you've been spying on Rasputin all by yourself? Ugh, this girl's trying to give me a heart attack. I can't let Rasputin get away with whatever he's doing. He's going to damage my father's honor. We understand how you feel, but aren't you taking a few too many risks? If you go back and reveal Rasputin's scheming to the Empress, she'll listen to you, won't she? No, my mother never believes anything I say. Now, now, Princess. But if Rasputin has such control over the palace, Princess Anastasia's life is in danger. Rasputin is planning on doing something at the victory reception, right? That's right. That's what I think he said, anyway. What's this victory celebration? His Majesty Tsar Nikola II, Emperor of Russia, is out touring the, for the front, but he'll soon return to Petrograd. The victory reception will be a celebration of his return. Okay, how about this? We can be your bodyguards until your dad gets back. Block is like, oh, oh, that's a great idea. I can't believe you came up with it. Shut up. Geppetto and I can be tutors, Yuri and Joachim attendants, Lucia a traveling fortune teller, and Blanca a new pet. That way, we can guard the Princess Anastasia with... 
And we can get into the Hermitage without any trouble. It sounds like a good idea, but do you really think it'll work? And Block is just looking at everybody as they're talking. Yeah, I don't know. You guys all look pretty suspicious. So do you. Okay, I know. All of you, come with me. I can get you entry on site into the Winter Palace. You're just having fun with Block. <laughs> yeah. But I do have some bad news for you. It is time for Puppers to go bye bye. Yep. I know. It's okay. I can see Puppers in cutscenes. That's right, I have to pick in. I have to put Bifrons back on. Yeah, I think this is pro I think this is usually my end my main party. Greet the Empress too. Please be on your best behavior, everyone, and thank you for guarding the princess. I'll just take that lottery ticket from you there, Mr. Edgar. What do you got in your back room, Edgar? Any sweet gosh? No. Dude lives in his shop. What a loser. To the palace to try and uncover Rasputin's evil ways. Da -da -da -da. To be the pillar the treasure note was talking about, but this sure as I can't behave like it. Kato, why are you reading the Emmy Gray manuscript? I don't care. You know, oh, he's the secret Japanese envoy Nikolai was meeting with. I think he wants it to bring something back. It certainly seems to be the authentic article. Well, we do aim to please. May I consider our negotiations to be completed then? Yes. Whatever may happen within Russia, the goodwill of Japan will extend to whomever the next emperor may be. I'm afraid I'll require more than that. You don't need to worry. I'm the direct representative of the Foreign Minister Kantaro Ishimura. My words may be considered the will of the Emperor. 
We look forward to establishing joint aviation and communication companies with you. Naturally, we'll shoulder the full cost. Naturally. By summer, we should be able to supply you with rations and fully modern weapons. Thank you. It sounds good. When do you think I will be able to meet with His Holiness, Lord Rasputin? I'm so sorry. His Holiness is terribly busy. That's fine. Please give the future Emperor my best. Our friend is no longer our friend. Naturally. Whoever takes over the throne will find a true friend in my country. Huh. Kato, you are like our dude. And now he's like, nah. Yeah, that's true. All right, well, since we're still controlling Anastasia, let's go get some snacks. <laughs> well, I think to get snacks, I have to talk to our mother. Who seems to be out of Mama! Alexei! Anybody? Hell, Rasputin, where are you guys? I bet they're in the throne room. Jesus, how many save points do you need to give me? I don't know how many times you yes. can forget your fucking save. All the times, I guess. Oh, we can finally go into this door. Fancy white door. Oh, Princess Anastasia, the Empress is waiting for you in the Great Hall. Okay. Once upon a December? Well, more like once upon a February. And so, these are the ones who saved the princess from the vicious wild dog. Anastasia, what on earth were you doing out at night? Well, I had an important chore to take care of at Edgar's. Oh? Huh? You couldn't take care of it tomorrow? No. Nevertheless, even if you did save my daughter's life, we cannot allow strange people to wander around inside the castle. But why? There's nothing wrong with them! How can you be so certain? You would resist me whatever I said. Because you're kind of a bitch, Mom. But... <laughs> Why not go easy on her, Empress? Lord Rasputin! Anastasia is at a naturally curious age. Blanca, no light. She's bound to have an adventure or two. Surely it was God's will that she be saved by these kind benefactors. You surprise me, Lord Rasputin. They're clearly travelers from far away. I'm sure they'll be fine companions to the princess. Mm. Very well. Anastasia, you may go with the strangers. I should like to thank you again for saving my daughter's life. Have a pleasant stay in my land. Thank you, Empress. It's gonna be super unpleasant because we gotta fight literal demons and shit. Uh, 
Still alive, I see, little one. So you're Rasputin, eh? Yes. And I've heard of you too, Godslayer. You were behind my familiar's death. Huh? Huh? Veronica! Hmm. Long time no see. <laughs> do you wish to fight here? I do. Yeah. Maybe. Uh, let's not. There's no need to get blood all over this lovely church. It's a palace. I'll be in the Lion Shrine to the north. Call on me anytime you wish. Anastasia. <laughs> I feel like that would be you standing behind me. <laughs> <laughs> So that's Rasputin, huh? He's got a look of danger just behind that creepy smile of his. He's obviously an ordinary man. He's on a whole different plane from Nikolai or Lenny. Yeah, it looks like it. Come on now, everybody. Don't look so glum. Now's the time we put our heads together and come up with a strategy. Lucia's right, everybody. Okay, let's go to my room. Then we can talk in peace there. Okay. Alright. A big deal. We don't dance around here. I hate that tune. So the ball has begun? Can we go? It's every night. Every night. There's something wrong with them. This whole country is insane. Maybe it should disappear. Hang on. The people's anger is ready to explode and we pretend nothing's going on. We're like Nero. We keep on fiddling as the world is burning around us. It's the same problem for all leaders. This country has gotten too big. Yep. Yep, yep. Mm, don't say that. You'll bring us bad luck. That's right. There are a lot of people that still have dreams. I worry. Someday I'm afraid the people's anger will explode and they'll burn down my palace. He first came to the palace some years ago. My mother was in anguish over Alexei, born with a rare and painful disease. One day, a man came from Siberia who was said to have great powers of healing. That was the monk, Rasputin. Rasputin healed my brother's illness and earned the trust of my mother. Since then, he has begun to wield greater control over the country. My father himself is a kind man but he has left too much to his ministers. Their idea of government is one which simply keeps the people oppressed. 
and anger towards the emperor who allows it is threatening to boil over. Even the war could soon be ended if my father would stand up and be strong. But there are some who profit from war and wish for it to go on forever. Indeed. If I were a man, I'd be able to help my father. Well, you're I not. I wish I were in Alexei's place. Anastasia. Russia is infected by a disease. We're a statue too stiff to move. <laughs> I'm half Russian, you know. My mother was born and bred in Russia. Uh, really? Yeah. So don't get so depressed, all right? If the princess gives up, Everyone else will, too. Yuri. When your father comes back, you should talk to him. He'll understand how you feel. He loves you, doesn't he? Yeah. Good girl. Now I steal some snacks. Yum, yum. Less, yeah, less yum. More dark recipe to follow. Something... Strange is going on. Uh, the Russian people are zombies now. Uh, Alexei? Alexei? Where are you? Uh, mother! Alexei, is that you? What's wrong with Alexei? Why are you looking for him? Uh, Alexei! Veronica's behind this, too. She's cast a sleep spell on the entire palace. How do we remove it? Either break the field, or defeat Veronica herself. I like that second part. Uh, uh, Defeating Veronica. Uh, uh, Mother! Uh, not anymore, she's not. Oh, come on, really? I can skip the movie. Like, I didn't save too fu too long ago. That is true. Uh, go back and come back. Till next time, everybody.